Hello YouTube, this is Apple Tech coming at you guys with the top 5 tweaks for iOS 3. Now this will be episode 1 of the top 5 tweaks, so stay tuned for more episodes for iOS 3. So if you like this video, just make sure to give it a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe up there if you're not subscribed already. And if you like any of these tweaks in this video, just make sure to leave a comment in the comment section below. So with that being said, let's get on to the first tweak of this week. So coming in at number one is called Launch Confirm. You can find it in the Mod My repo for free. And as I said, all these tweaks are compatible with iOS 3. And there will be nothing on your springboard, just something in your settings as you guys can see right there. Now you want to click on it and you want to enable and you can disable the tweak, which is a very nice feature. Um, right here you want to disable this one this one doesn't really do nothing as you guys can see it has an error but you just want to disable it and you just want to enable this one now when I install this one you may have to respring for it to be working now what this tweak simply does it just allows you to get a pop-up whenever you enter any application as you guys can see it tells me if I want to enter it or no if I don't want to enter it so I just click yes and then it will launch my photos just like that so this works for any application that you want to launch. You just simply tap on it and then click yes or no. It may get annoying at some times, but it is pretty useful if you are the kind of clumsy person that clicks on the wrong app and then you don't really want to go into that app. So it's just a matter of preference if you want it. So once again, it's called Launch Confirm. Make sure to check it out in Cydia, folks. So coming in at number two, folks, is called Moti Wall. Now this one you can find it in the Mod My repo for free and what this does it just allows you to have multiple wallpapers on your springboard as you guys can see if I swipe through my springboard pages I have a different wallpaper for each one so this is a very nice touch if you do not like one wallpaper for all of them and to me this kind of looks like a panorama um, Android wallpaper to me on an iPhone which is a very nice so when you download this one from Cydia there will be nothing on your springboard but there will be something in your settings um, which is a kind of useful but not very useful at the same time right there it's called multi wall and this one just has one theme as you guys can see so I believe this one you can SSH into your device and add more and as you guys can see it goes up to 11 pages so if you have 11 pages there will be different multi wallpapers for those so this tweak is just great if you want multiple wallpapers on your springboard at once as you guys can see it keeps going on and on so it's just a great tweak to have as you guys can see it even gives a wallpaper for the spotlight search so once again this one is called multi wall make sure to check it out in city of folks so coming in at number three is called power up you can find this one in the mod my repo for free now when you download this one there will be nothing on your springboard just something in your settings to configure so you want to scroll down until you find power up right there and now what this has you can enable the safe mode when the power up pops up so as you guys can see it says style right here you can tap on that you can have the action and the alert view which is very nice now right here they have the black the transparent and the default one so you can mess around with these settings which is a very nice touch. Now you guys will also have to put an activation method to this tweak for it to pop up. So I usually have mine on short holding the home button. So as you guys can see, I have it right there, power up. So you just wanna tap on it and it's simply set like that. So if I just exit out and hold the home button, as you guys can see, I have a various of options of powering off, rebooting, respringing, or going into safe mode. And this is just great if your device is running slow and you want to respring, or if you need a reboot and um, you don't want that infinity loop that you get in Cydia if you are running white door sometimes. So this is a great tweak to have. Once again, folks, it's called power up. So coming in at number four is called quick Google. Now you can find this one in the Big Boss repo for free and this one just allows you to get a quick Google search by using an activation method. So you want to use any activation method you want. I usually have mine on swiping down and as you guys can see it pops up with this that says quick Google. You can type something in, tap on Google and it's easy as that. It launches your Safari. So say if I just type in Apple Tech helping and let's see what we get on Google just tap on Google 
and as you guys can see it launches your Safari just like that which is a nice feature if you use Google a lot and you want a quick search without going to Safari and um, typing it in wasting all that time when you can just use an activation method just like that and as you guys can see we have my Twitter we have my YouTube we have my Facebook fan page or white door you can see me on white door so that is very nice once again folks it's a simple tweak it's called quick Google make sure you guys check it out in Cydia from the big boss repo for free so last but not least the fifth tweak I got for you guys is called SMS signature now what this does it just allows you to put your own custom signature when you SMS someone so this works when you're texting someone and you do want to go to your settings so you want to launch up your settings you want to scroll down and you want to find SMS signature just right there all you want to do is tap on enable and right here you just want to tap on that part and you can type in your signature I usually have mine as ATH which is Apple Tech helping you can put whatever you want and that's much it for the signature just enable it and you're mostly done so I'm gonna demonstrate you just by going to my messages app and sending someone a text message so say if I would just type in test and then type send as you guys can see it types my message with my signature on the bottom so this is just a great feature if you want a signature for your text messaging once again folks it's called SMS signature make sure to check it out in Cydia from the mod my repo for free so folks that's much to get for the top five tweaks for iOS 3 stay tuned for more videos like this this is Apple Tech thanks for watching